Having a CRA My Account is a must for every Canadian. And in today's video, I'm going to walk you through how to set one up on the CRA website. So the first thing we're going to do is get to the CRA website. And once you're there, you're going to look for the green button that says sign into a CRA account. Look for another green button that says My Account. Again, My Account for Individuals. Next, since this is our first time uh, creating an account, we're going to hit that CRA register button. From there, we're gonna enter our SIN number. That's our social insurance number. Uh, you can get that either from your SIN card that you may have, uh, or if you have a copy of your prior year tax return handy, uh, it'll be on your tax return. So enter in your SIN. And then it's going to ask for a bit more information about you. So your postal code, your birthday, and a line from your previous year's tax return. Uh, you'll most likely be able to find that line on the notice of assessment. Or if you do have a prior year return handy, just look for the line that it's asking for and enter in the dollar value. Hit next. Now you're going to want to confirm the postal code because the CRA is going to be sending you a kind of verification letter with a certain code on it uh, and that's going to open up your CRA My Account uh, for full access purposes. So you want to make sure that your postal code is correct uh, or if you're using a diff different postal code, um, this is your time to enter that in uh, so that way you actually receive this verification code. So we're going to confirm that postal code uh, and now we're going to create our username and password. So just follow the rules and guidelines that the CRA is asking for both the username and password. So enter those in now. Once done, it's going to uh, run through a few questions and answers for security purposes if you do forget your password or if you're logging in on an unknown device. So you're going to enter those in and then review those questions and answers once done. Now it's going to take us to a terms and condition, conditions page. Once you read that over and you accept the terms and conditions, enter the password that you just created and click I agree. The next page is just letting you know that the security code is being sent to your postal code. So you're going to want to hit next. Again, it's going to run you through a bit more terms and conditions. So read through those and hit next again. And that's it. We're done. Uh, this is your CRA My Account with limited access. Uh, once you get that security code within 10 days, you'll be able to go back to your account, enter in that security code, and you'll have full access. So once we have full access, uh, we're able to do things like review our previous tax returns and notice of assessments, um, be able to change our address, and check the status of our current year tax return as well. So that's the video. Uh, if you got value out of this, please give it a thumbs up, and happy taxing!